In diagrams.net, what you can also do is if you are using the web version right here, then you can work in real time as well with other user. So to do that, first of all, you need to share out the file with other person. So if I were to click on share, then what you can do is you can go around, add in the other email address and then give them editor privilege right here. So I'm using Google Drive and depending on the cloud storage service that you connect diagrams.net with, you will get similar option. So I'm just going to go around over here and change to YouTube channel 2 at gmail.com as an editor and click on save. So once I do that, what happens is that the other person will be able to access uh, the same file just like this so they can go around interrupt the file address right here and they will have access to the same file uh, right here by using the same URL or by checking out their email. So if I were to go around right here, you can see that as the other person goes around and makes edits, you can see that it gets changed out over here as well. So you can go around, make up the uh, edits right here, just like this. And you will also see the edit that the other person is doing. And just like this, you can go around and work around with this in real time. They can go around and make some changes right here. You can go around, make changes and everything happens in real time, as you can see right there. So you can do this with more than one person as well. And that is how collaborating in real time works just like that. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.